Following the ratification of his appointment as Corps Marshal of the Federal Road Safety Corps by President Muhammadu Buhari on the 30th of December 2022, the newly appointed FRSC Corps Marshal Ali Biu inspects the guard at the headquarters of the Federal Road Safety Corps in Abuja. The Secretary to the Government of the Federation, Mr. Boss Mustafa, who coordinated Mr. B's official declaration, states that this is the second time in the Corps' history that a Corps Marshal has risen from the ranks. We felt strongly as a government that we must promote career progression so that when people join an organization, they should be looking up to get into the pinnacle of that organization before the terminal date of their exit from those organizations. The official decoration begins. The new Corps Marshal who joined the Corps in 1988 holds a master's degree in business administration and a bachelor of science degree in accounting from Amadubelo University, Zaria. He takes over from Boboye Oyeyemi, who retired in July of 2022. <laughs> Speaking to journalists afterwards, Mr. Beery states the Corps' commitment to meeting its mandate, especially with the general elections barely a month away. There are members of two committees in the INEC. We have the standing committee, and then we have the logistics committee. So currently our members, our officers are part of that process. So that's what should be expected from us. We deploy, we have vehicles that will deploy so that materials can get to the polling booth at the right time. And then we have men also that will control the conduct at the, at the polling booth. The new Corps Marshal of the Federal Safety Corps has his work cut out for him, especially with the upcoming elections. And of course, this is a boost to members of the Corps that they can aspire to these great levels. However, the whole of 2023 will test the resolve of the Corps to ensure that there is safety on Nigeria's roads and ensure that the elections are actually coordinated properly. Kayla Magua Channels, Television News.